happening now? Drug and gang prevention, auto theft, gun buyback, and now traffic safety. Yeah, the San Juan PD launched its new community-based summer program for 2013. And this year, it's all about taking back the streets from speeders. A year-long study of the worst neighborhoods for speeding is mapped out by the San Juan PD. We have identified three neighborhoods that we're going to be looking at. Chief Juan Gonzalez says the areas in red get the most calls for reckless driving. That's when someone's driving more than double the speed limit. And in the city, nearly all of the residential speed zones are posted at 20 miles per hour. If people think that they're not going to get arrested for reckless driving, they are. Officers arrested six people for reckless driving last year. Citizens phoned in 168 complaints to the PD. Loma Linda, south of Sioux Road, tops that list. Because they can pick up speeds from 20 all the way to 80 miles per hour in, in just this small stretch. The chief's new neighborhood speed watch program hopes to put the brakes on speeders. Areas identified in the traffic study for the highest number of complaints, tickets, and arrests for reckless driving will see immediate action in the form of increased patrol, new signage, and either speed bumps, humps, or buttons like this for the road. So we're going to be doing that probably in the next 30 days. Oh, really? Yes, sir. Oh, I love so, uh, yeah. People along Loma Linda learned of the upcoming safety improvements firsthand from the chief. The news is met with plenty of praise. Ten thumbs up on that one. Residents will also be informed of the neighborhood speed watch program through the mail. Maria Martinez is a mother of two who lives along Sun Valley Street, just west of Cesar Chavez, another area in the pilot program, which includes Retama near Eldora. I think it's a good idea. I mean, especially when we have kids, it will be great. You know, that way we have, we feel more secure. The project is funded with forfeitures to save taxpayer dollars, but the real focus... We got to have the community on board. ...to save lives. Hats off to San Juan PD. If you live in the city and want to join the Neighborhood Speed Watch program, contact the police department to initiate a traffic study. What do you think about the city's newest initiative to safeguard those streets? Share your thoughts with me on my Facebook and Twitter pages. Just search Ryan Wolf. I'm online right now.